In 2023, we saw a lot of funding go to the infrastructure layer for Gen AI and proportionally a much smaller amount of funding go to the application layer. I'm curious to hear insights on that general trend and whether we're gonna see that shift and see more funding to help actually take this technology and create stuff that has tangible value in the market. First, funding is not a good indicator of where the interesting opportunities are. You know, we invest in OpenAI, we made that decision in 2018. Once it's successful, everybody wants to invest in that area. People were doing crypto, people were doing Web3. Suddenly, everybody wants to do AI. So I'd, uh, I'd sort of say, don't focus where the crowd is going. Uh, they're mostly just following each other as lemmings. Go where first principles thinking says something can be done. It's very exciting to see how you could transform media, music, animation, lots of things in media. It's exciting to see how you could change programming and how you could change robotics. All kinds of other tools I've mentioned things like chip design or product design or website design or antibody design in biology. You pick your favorite area. There's so much to do. Are these things going to get more important? Yes. But we probably already have more than 35, 40 investments in these application areas and always looking for more. Don't follow what others are doing. Think for yourself from first principles. Where can AI make a large difference and apply your thinking? So this is where good AI people need to team up with the right kinds of investors to even discuss what areas to apply themselves to. Uh, by the way, if somebody gets interested in primary care or AI tutors for everybody, which is non profit, I'd love to have them work with these companies. We are recruiting in all these areas. But there's probably 40 other companies recruiting for AI talent in our portfolio.